In this video, we are gonna make these social icon cards, using the Elementor free version. That means, it is free. So, don't skip and watch the whole video. Hi, I am Alex from Essential Web Apps. These types of social cards are useful if you have multiple types of accounts on a single social media network. Like, a Facebook page, Facebook group, or owner's Facebook profile. You can put it on your homepage, or you can put it on the contact page. Either way, it is a very effective and smart layout design. By the way, we make videos on WordPress, website and social media strategy, web design, and development. To see our regularly uploaded videos, please hit the subscribe buttons and click the bell icon for notification. Let's start with selecting a three block structure. Then give it a margin. Now add an icon block, and change it to the Facebook logo. Change the color to white. Give a background color. Give it padding. Also border radius. Now add a list below. Customizing the list items. Make some copies of it. Changing the texts. As I said, it is very functional for multiple accounts on the same social media networks. Need some spacing for list items. Align it in the middle. Turn on the divider option. Change the text color and fix the typography. Ok, now, add a CSS class for the whole block. Add another one for the lists. As you can see, I am using double underscore for this class naming, and that's because I am following the BEM rule here. This is one of the best practices we follow, for all of our premium WordPress theme lineups. Now let's inspect this. First, let's target the class for the list. Hide the visibility. Now, let's target the social box class, and add a hover selector. Let's bring back the visibility for hover action. It's working great. And, you can use it, as it is on your site. Minimal, and requires very little CSS modification. Here is the full CSS styling of the modification, until now. But, if you like a bit of animation on your site, then keep watching. Let's target the list class again. Adding the Opacity property, and Transition property. Enable the Hover action for the block first. Now, add the Opacity value to 1 for the Hover state.
Disable the hover action. It is looking nice now. I am going to add a few more styling to the block. It will occur on hover, so adding a transition. For hover action, I will add a light background color and a border radius. All looks good, now I will copy the added CSS lines, and paste these into the additional CSS section. You can find this under Appearance, then Customization from the WordPress dashboard. All done, now published. Make two duplicates. Change the contents real quick. Click Update. And with that, we are done with this gorgeous looking social card animation. So there you go. Do you like this video? If so, then please hit the thumbs up and subscribe. We are a team of premium WordPress themes creators, working in this field since 2010. So, if you need a business website for your business to grow, please check the description for our premium WordPress themes. And, I will see you in the next video.